Hey YouTube, Chris White here, owner of Chris White's Tree Service and Driver Repair. Just showing you guys on what I'm doing today. I'm going to be adding some counterweight balances to my mini skid steer. Um, I bought a, a grapple, a log grapple for the front, and it's for a full size mini skid steer. A little big for this machine, so it's it's off probably like 150 pounds or so. Uh, too much weight in the front, so I'm hoping to create a counterbalance that's about 100, 120 pounds, somewhere in there. Um, we're gonna get that weighed out to see how much they weigh. And also, uh, this is the cheapest way I could find, at least locally up here in Northern California. Uh, I just went to the local uh, steel shop and I bought 82 pounds of scrap metal. And uh, that's a dollar a pound here. And I'm gonna, they're uh, square tubes and I'm gonna fill them full of concrete. I got two 60 pound bags of concrete. And then I'm hoping to weld them on to, um, not on the skid steer, but I'm gonna weld up some bracing that'll hopefully bolt on to the bolts that are already there. Hopefully it works out. Alrighty, I really appreciate you guys for tuning in. Feel free to hit that like, subscribe, and share button. I sure would appreciate it. Let's get into it. Alrighty YouTube, this is what we're dealing with. I got this five by five beam right here and I got this scrap metal right here and I do got some more scrap metal later on too hopefully that works but that was 82 pounds of scrap metal and then I got two bags of concrete which I'm gonna fill those up and hopefully we get the weight that we need
Hey YouTube, Chris White here. Just giving you guys an update. Uh, we're getting pretty close to finishing these counterweights. I'm just going to show you on how I measured this part. It's kind of hard to record over here. Uh, it's because it's starting to get dark. But I'm going to show you how I measured it. Just in case you guys think I'm some master engineer or something. This is how I measured it. Check it out. So. I took that apart. You can see I leveled that out. The, the machine's pretty much level. It's tilting a little to the right. But... And then I got that bar clamped on there. And I pre drilled that hole. So I just got to weld that on there. Alrighty, let's get to it.
Hey YouTube, let's do a little walk around. Let's get to deer. Those things are sweet. So you got this grapple on here. It's a little overkill for the little 320. Alrighty, I'll show you guys uh, what this thing can pick up later when I find a log. Sweet. These things are not going anywhere. As you can see, you can see me make up. And if I grab this, it doesn't move at all. And kind of protect you from branches and stuff. So. 